Hey there, welcome to another Addicting Games walkthrough. My name is Mike. I'm here with my friend Sid. Say hi, Sid. No! All right, Sid is a champion uh, video gamer. Uh, I just hate robots. And he hates robots. And how appropriate that we're playing Crash the Robot today. It's a game where you help a robot self-destruct. Perfect. Let's get to it. I like these new intros. Uh, I don't like that robot. Oh, good. That's what he deserves. Robots took my job. Sid, this is the perfect game for you. <laughs> a little revenge on the robots. Robot re Oh, bombs. I like bombs. So you put the bomb in the right place, set off the switches. The robot can't do anything else but self-destruct. Oh, happy. Mm. All right, level two. So there's like physics. There's some physics involved. You want to move certain things out of the way. Basically flip the switches so the robot can destruct. Once the switch is green, my robot's in danger. All right, okay. That's correct. Oh, a saw blade. That looks promising. Uh, okay. Saw blades, magnets, switches, robots. All right, so... Oh boy. Now it's starting to get a little complicated. What do you think, Sid? It is complicated. I'm glad you did this right on the first time. I would not have the patience. I appreciate the destruction. I like the saw blades. Yeah, the saw blades are kind of nice. There's also some uh, trampoline bouncy thingies that you, you can use to uh, bounce items around and pop balloons and such. Oh. Uh, yes. Oh, beat yourself with a hammer. That's what I like to see. Uh, now let's see what's going on here. You want to balance or throw the board off balance. There we go. Equals dead robot. I didn't always hate robots. I used to be a robot teacher, and I thought that robots were our nation's most precious resource. And then what happened? I spent time with robots. You did time with robots? I, well, I was in the classroom with them, and uh, they're cruel. I didn't appreciate it. They were smarter than me too, and I didn't appreciate that either. Not so smart now, are you, Mr. Blow Up? Mr. Robot Parts, ha ha ha. Blow Bot. No Bot, ha 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 ha. Oh, this all. Oh, ah. nothing robots hate more than being shocked. It's ironic, they live by electricity, and yet they can die by electricity. Ironic or funny? I guess it's funnier than ironic. It's thought-provoking, at least, yes. Now, in this one, you basically want to hit as many of these switches as you can for maximum points. And I'm not sure what the bombs do, other than get, give you some pretty fireworks. He must have a... Uh, ah, he went to scrap bowl. Yeah. Alright, level 10. Which means we've destroyed nine robots to date. It's a good start. Here we have an elaborate system of uh, magnets. Switches. Switches. Oh, yes. Saw blades. Oh, he blew himself up before the saw blade hit. That shows you what, what charlatans and cowards robots really are. Oh, please don't hurt me. Oh, please don't drop a hammer in my head. All robots talk like little sissies. All robots talk like their pants are too tight. <laughs> I like that. I'd like to see a robot with his head between those two hammers. Clonk. Oh. Uh. 
Oh, he's squatting in fear. Ha! Oh, what a good attention. Level 13. This, this is a spooky one. Oh, oh! That's all it takes. Is that was a delicate roll. <laughs> It's almost as if he knows what's coming. I appreciate the speed with which you destroy these robots, Mike. It encourages me. Just doing my civic duty. Robots ask for it. The way they dress. The smirk they make. He does have kind of a cool getup, though. He's like a Viking robot. Kind of a Viking robot. I salute, I salute his Viking helmet. Robot with some personality. You think this robot was made in the Norse country? He may be a Swedish robot, that's true. He does have a dirty mouth. Swedes, Swedes swear like sailors, as I am. They swear like Vikings. Vikings yeah. swear like sa sailors, yes. Yeah. Yeah, as they are. So it only goes to me. It makes perfect sense that robots have dirty mouths. <laughs> Only one more reason why these robots should be destroyed. You can't wash their mouths out in soap. No, it? and they're they're inadequate babysitters. And they, they I, I saw a robot walk a dog, and he really missed the point entirely. Well, I hope their house broke at least. That's a good point. <laughs> I would not want a robot that I have to clean up after. Uh oh. Yes, remove your head out of shame. Ah. Robot pooping school game. No, thank you. Oh, that's why robots love never be pets. Oh, oh. nicely done. Nicely done. Take that, robot. Now the unfortunate thing is that uh, we've only figured out how to kill and destroy the first 20 robots. So we're gonna have to get back to you with the last 20 robots. No doubt they will be, you know, I don't want to say smarter, but they'll probably be hiding better than the new ones. Uh, oh, you can deploy your own saw blade. Now that's a happy occasion. I need one of those in my car. Kablamo, kablamo, boom, boom, boom. Yes, see, there he is, sweeting. He's a swearing in Swedish. Very good. All right, well, that is our first 20 levels of uh, Crash Robot. We'll be back with more soon.